Hi there, it's Jen from Simple Green Smoothies and today we are going to be making my lemon melt away recipe, which is from my new book called Simple Green Meals, where there's over 100 plant powered recipes that are simple to make and extra tasty. For this recipe, we are making sure to have lots of healthy fats in it, which is why it helps curb your appetite and makes it a great snack. So the first ingredient we are going to add to our blender are cashews. We are doing half a cup of cashews and we are gonna pulse them finely to create almost like a cashew flour or a cashew powder out of them. If you don't have a blender, you can also use a food processor for this. It's not gonna get it as fine and creamy, but it'll still work. Next, we're gonna add in the maple syrup and the lemon juice and just pour it right into the blender. This is two tablespoons of freshly squeezed lemon juice and two tablespoons of maple syrup. Feel free to cut down or add more of either of those depending on how sweet or flavorful you want it. All right, now we're gonna put the lid back on and blend again. The last step is adding in the coconut oil and a little bit of salt. In this recipe, we're using organic, unrefined coconut oil. This is the purest form you can get of coconut oil. It also has the highest content of medium chain triglycerides in coconut oil, and it also freezes well, which is what we're trying to do in this recipe. So make sure to use organic, unrefined coconut oil. Last thing we're doing is adding that pinch of sea salt. And now it's time to blend again. All right, now that it's all blended, we are going to be pouring it into our ice cube tray here. That is made of silicone, which makes it a lot easier to get out. You can also use a baking sheet and adding a layer of wax paper and that will work as well. So we're gonna pour about a, probably about quarter inch high amount of this into each of the trays. I think I did a little too much on that one, but it's okay. That'll just be a bigger snack. All right, now they are fully in the ice cube tray, as you can see. I'm gonna put the lid on them. If you don't have something with a lid, you can also wrap it in um, paper towel or saran wrap, whatever you have. Okay, time to put it in the freezer. All right, it only takes a few hours for these to freeze, but once they do, you can pop them out of here really easily. squares, which are bite-sized snacks. Do it over here. Two more. All right, depending how hungry you are, you can make these smaller, bigger, it's totally interchangeable, whatever you want for your little snack. But this is the size I like to have. You need to store these in the freezer until you're ready to eat them. So what I like to do is put them in a glass tight, freezer safe container. Whenever you want a little snack and you're not ready for a meal, these are simple and light and refreshing. So pull it out of the freezer, grab one, take a bite and you're good to go. It literally melts in your mouth. It's amazing. Mm. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you found it helpful and exciting and that you are going to make these for your next snack. 
If you like the recipe, give it a thumbs up. Also make sure to subscribe to our channel where we're constantly releasing new delicious recipes that are gonna help you feel your passion through plant-powered goodness. All right, have a great day, bye.